Hello, once again, welcome to my video. Go ahead, pull up a chair, get your favorite cup of Bustello. If you're listening to this in the night, get, get a cup of soda or heck, you know, alcoholic drink, doesn't matter. One, one, want to go ahead and just welcome you in. Now, right now it's the 1st of July, new month, new chapter in your life. You fully closed the book on June, and now we are just looking forward, not looking back. Right now, we're just looking forward. Let me ask you this. What have you accomplished in June? Now, I'm not talking the major goals. Like, I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to pressure y'all or I'm not trying to make you feel a certain way. I'm just asking, what did you set out in June to do? And what were you able to get done? It doesn't matter if it's a minor step. Hey, maybe you uh, were able to mow your lawn or do some laundry. I mean, I'm, I, I'd like to think we'd all do that uh, <laughs> more than once a month, but I, I don't judge. No, what I'm really, really, really looking at is think about it in this sense, right? We're always constantly thinking about the big picture. Now, what is that big picture to everybody, right? You know, for me, uh, I always say this 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 and counting figure in it, but we really don't talk about, okay, what, what goes into that journey? What goes into that journey where you can say to yourself, you know what, what do I need to get done right now? I'm sorry, not right now, but in the, in the metaphysical sense, what needs to happen between right now and where I want to get to? What are the steps I need to take? You know, there are always different objectives, different goals, goals within goals that you will have to reach first before we can get to the pinnacle. You know, the, the, the best saying in life is that it's not always about the destination, but more so just the journey that you take in order to get to that destination. So let's, let's turn back the clock. What have we done in June? Or, you know, if you're, if you're listening to this on a uh, different time, you know, go back to the last day, the last week, the last month, and think to yourself, you know what? What did I get done during that stretch of time that has allowed me to move forward in the right direction? Now, if, if we can't think of a particular goal or anything like that, now that's okay. As long as, long as we are not going backward, you know, we're either staying right, not to say we don't, don't want to stay right where we are, but if we're either staying right where we are or moving forward, even just a very small step, a very small baby step, then that's okay. That's all right. You don't have to take the giant step every day. You don't have to take the giant step every week. That's not what life is about. Life is always about exploring. Life is about learning. Life, it's all just about enjoying because we all want to enjoy life. We only got one on this fantastic planet we call Earth. And I don't want to get into the astrology or the spiritual beliefs of anybody here because that's not the time nor the place to get into it. But right now, let's talk. Every step that you take, whether indirectly or directly, is going to allow you to get to that place, allow you to get to that point where you're going to think back and say to yourself, wow, I'm glad I took that particular step or wow, I'm glad I did this action or wow, you know, without doing this or without this happening, I would have never gotten to this point. And it's, I mean, it's always those very small little actions, those very minor actions that we often overlook because we're not talking about, you know, the big major thing that happened or the big milestone we were supposed to accomplish and haven't gotten done yet. But, but truth be told, if we all thought that way, if we always looked for the big, big, big expectations, not to say that you shouldn't have any, because we all do. We all have big expectations and we all are comp and at least the mindset is you're going to be confident enough to get to that particular point. But at the same time, we got to just say to ourselves, what have we done? No, let's let's take a moment to celebrate the fact that you're getting to that point. All right. We're not. We're not all perfect. We're not 100% right all the time. If that were the case, then life would be so damn boring. Pardon my French. Life would be so boring. 
Life would be, we'd be essentially be robots, not humans, and that ain't fun. <laughs> I mean, with humans, it's natural to make mistakes. It's natural to taste a little bit of failure. You know, failure isn't the end all be all of everything. Failure, in fact, I think of it like this without that failure, how could you taste that success? You know, without learning or going through those little robot blocks in life, going through those little blocks in life, how could you ever get to the point where you have finally taste success? And you know, it's much better to taste that success if there's just a little bit of obstruction or you know, something blocking you. Now, of course, we'll, I always talk about, you know, removing those blockages, right? Removing those obstacles. But at, the, but at some point, you have to get to those obstacles before, before you remove them. And so think about those, think about even, um, let's even go back to uh, this week, right? Because again, we are, uh, we're starting off a new week, depending on when you're watching this particular video, it could be the end of the week, it could be the beginning of the week. Just think about the prior week, the prior day, the prior month. Again, what have we, because again, what both of us are going to, are going to go through this journey together, uh, myself and the view, we are going to go through this journey of life together. So let's talk about, or let's think about the things we were able to do in order to move forward in the right direction. Again, it could be just about anything. Now, again, clearing those obstacles, clearing, clearing your energy, even doing something as small as just reaching out to your people or, you know, being able to partake within your community. It's being able to enjoy life because that's what, you know, because we're here to enjoy part of our part of our time here on Earth is to enjoy the Earth that we have, enjoy the things that we have, enjoy the time and activities that are available to us. Just think. All right. Think of those things that create some positive memories, some positive energy, some positive actions that you've taken and realize that within those small little actions that you took each day, within those small little actions that you took each week, within those small little actions that you took each month, it could, again, the smallest thing. Now, if you did a big uh, major thing or a, a a huge thing, then awesome. Uh, that's that's act, that's excellent. You know that allow if you're able to take a big step forward this week, then I'm proud of you. Keep at it. And for those who are just taking a very 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 small step to this day, I want you to go ahead and remember this. Rome wasn't built in the day. You know the fa famous podcasters of the world, the famous celebrities, music artists, teachers scientists, all everything, right? It didn't happen right away. It didn't go overnight. It was not an overnight miracle just like that. It took time. The steps had to be taken. The actions had to be taken in order for everyone that we look up to in order to be able to get to where they are and where they're planning on going to be. Because, I'm, because everybody on this earth has a specific calm. And even if that particular calling has not been has not been awakened yet, right? We are all still figuring out life's journey because life has prepared a journey for us. And the most incredible thing about it is we're all going through our different time frames on this journey. Some might be starting, some might be in the middle, and some may just be getting there. And that's all right, because if there's one thing that I know is that we are all, listen, uh, news flash, we all are going to die at some point. We are all going, we do not have an inf infinite life. You know, we have one life, we have one journey on earth. And so no matter where you're at on your journey, you've taken steps to get there. You've taken hopefully positive steps to get there. And so whatever you've done in this week, in this month, this day, heck, even the past hour, whatever you've done, if it's something that's allowing you to be able to just move forward in a way that you want to move forward, then keep going. Because at the end of the day, 
whether somebody says, you know, what have you done for me lately, right? The question is, that question you just have to ask yourself. And if you can answer with confidence that, yes, I've been able to do this, then fantastic. Doesn't matter what the next person has done. Doesn't matter what anyone is doing, you know, compared to me, because I'm not a man who makes comparisons. All I'm worried about is number one, what my mission is, what my objective is, and how I'm going to get there, what steps have I taken to get there. And so I hope that my men the mentality is I hope that everyone is able to get to their path. Because I'll tell you what, life is an incredible journey. And that incredible journey begins with one single step. Actually, you know what? <laughs> yeah, let me go back. Let me go back. We're all babies once. So we had to crawl first. Life begins with one simple crawl. Then as we keep crawling along, you were learning to walk. Then after we walked, we ran. And then, you know, when we, when we run, whew, there's no telling where you're going to go. There's no telling in life. There's no telling where in life you are going to go. And it will be twists, turns. There will be sideways, horizontal ways, down ways. You no, know, I, I always think of life as like a bullish market. Sometimes you just are going to get to your peaks. Sometimes you have to take a few lows. And sometimes it's a little consolidate. You're going sideways. But at the end of the day, no matter where we are, right? As long as we're able to think to ourselves, our mind is able to think to ourselves that we are going to get to that stage that we want to be. We're going to move forward and we are going to elevate and we are not going to look back at what happened. We're not going to look back at our mistakes. We're not going to look back at our accomplishments and say we are satisfied with those accomplishments. No, we understand that in life there is a lot of things that we could do out in this world. And my only question to you is what steps have you taken to get to the point that you want to go? And so with that being said, I encourage you to keep going. I encourage you to just keep firing away, accomplishing every goal that you want to set out for, whether minor, whether major. Get at it, get it done, and get it done hard and with 110% effort. Everybody, have a great day. Go be great and go be blessed.